there's two modes that our nervous system can be in in any moment. People don't know it, and it makes all the difference in the world. Bear with me. There's a sympathetic nervous system response. I'll make this sciencey sounding word easy to remember in a second. But sympathetic is like fight or flight, stressed and alone. The way you remember it is like how much sympathy you have for someone who is stressing the hell out. And the key thing to notice about sympathetic nervous system, so you can catch yourself when you're in it, not only does your heart beat faster and your breathing get more shallow and cortisol is pumping through your veins, but the voice in your head gets really mean and negative and fearful. The other mode you can be in is parasympathetic. Think of a parachute like catching you in the sky and you just have this peaceful, floaty, beautiful ride through life. That is parasympathetic. And the parasympathetic nervous system, our heart beats slower, our breath gets fuller. The stress hormones go down and the well-being hormones go up. And the voice in your head is honest and wise and compassionate. And in Social Skills for Life, we teach students how to notice which voice is talking to them. And in 10 or 15 seconds, you can flip into parasympathetic. You can throw out the parachute to catch yourself in that free fall of stress that you're experiencing. It is an absolute life changer. So that before you go into the test that you're feeling really stressed about, or maybe you found the courage to go for something you wanted and it didn't work out the way you wanted. Well, afterwards, are you gonna make sense of what happened from your sympathetic, stressed out fight or flight response with the negative, critical, fearful voice? Or are you gonna consciously tap into parasympathetic and then make sense of what happened? It is a different you, it is a different life. It is so important. And imagine learning to take this skill in as a teenager is absolutely gonna change your life.